in this episode of Hunt for the Golden Apple. I can smell it! What will be in this chest? Come here, broski! Ah, oh, game over! Wow. Holy crap. Okay then, now let's get rid of these. Let's, let's get myself a proper path in which to deal with these guys. Alright. There's plenty of them here. Alright. Alright, so more cocoa beans. What will be in this chest? Who knows? Two saddles. Gunpowder, redstone. Inventory is already full. It's kind of amazing. But none of the treasure we are looking for, so let, let's proceed, shall we? First double dungeon I have ever seen in my life. Well, not in my life, but in the life of this map, I mean. Not, not my life. This is the third one I believe I've ever seen before. Let's uh, destroy this one, too. I don't think I'll ever destroy a skeleton spawner. Uh, just, you know, for the sake of what it drops. But, you know, I mean, these, these don't drop anything really interesting. Wow, that, that, that is amazing. That is purely amazing. All right, let's continue on because this episode isn't long enough to cut off yet. Um, man, imagine if we found another. I need to make some torches, so let's get into the safe area over here and let's make some torches. Another zombie. That's all right, though. We'll deal with this. We'll deal with this in just a second. I definitely need to make myself some, uh, some torches here. Man, I'm just, I'm all shaky now and stuffs. All shaky that I found this so quickly. I mean, seriously, totally random occurrence. I mean, if this has been a good example of the typical outside, your typical outside uh, being like inside, like, let me rephrase that. What the mountains look like outside mimic what they look like on the inside. I think this is a clear indication that that might be total truth. I mean, think about it. Think about what we have just found. I'm going to fire off two arrows. So that I can combine the stack. I could have just dropped the arrows, but you know what? It's more interesting. Let's get our composure together here. Alright. Let's move on. That is what we need to do at this point. I heard zombies off that way. I'm not going to concern myself with it too much yet. Because I still have a lot of bear cave to explore. Unless I hear a ton of them. I hear all sorts of water. All sorts, all sorts of movement. Some skeletons. I don't want to go after skeletons in water, though. I've had bad experiences with skeletons. Oh, jeez. That, that scared me. I just didn't expect it. That's alright. Come on up here, Broski. Do not be afraid of death. I think maybe he drowned or something? I have no idea. Like, it, it didn't seem like I landed a blow with which to kill him. Alright, those are just... <laughs> I'm getting scared off of... I, not scared, but startled off of... Okay, that was the arrow that the skeleton actually fired. I was like, what is firing at me and not making noise while doing so? This has to be one of... like This is like a layered cave system. It seems like every area I've been in so far has like a layer below it. You know, like, but it's like, it's only, it only feels like an overhang sort of thing where you can see below you, but, you know, it's still really considered to be another floor. I want to get rid of, I'm going to get rid of this water here. Put that there to signify that that is where I get rid of water because water is annoying. It's annoying to travel through and I see no reason why to keep it around unless I'm going to use it. Which I probably actually should have kept it because I don't have a bucket of water to heal myself right now if I get trapped in lava. But let's get out of this this little area here. Seems like to be a dead end. Let's, uh, let's mark the dead end with, I don't know, a piece of dirt where it shouldn't be. I don't know if I'll ever remember that, but no matter. There's a lot of iron in this system. I'll mine it up, but I won't go after too, too much of it. And I'm not going to escape this area. If I do end up leaving this area, I'm probably going to come back. N unlike the last one. The last one, it just, uh, it had a very stringy cave system. It just, it was very skinny, very stringy, and I just didn't like it. Ant Venom did not approve of the last cave system. Man, though, I'm st I still have to get over that double dungeon. That was amazing. 
That was amazing. There's a natural sort of staircase here. Let's dig this area out. I'm loving that I'm not going to have to worry about brightening up, uh, brightening up cave systems with a ton of torches anymore because just of the way that I'm going to be editing the actual video. Doesn't seem like this opens up into anything. I saw, I heard zombies earlier though. I want to know where they were to find a different area. As far as I know though, there's a ton of different areas. And yes, I know I'm missing a ton of iron. I'm not going to concern myself with every single bit of it. But we can get uh, the stuff that's here now. Alright. The question is, am I lost? I don't think I am. I recognize this. It's going up. I just saw a graphical glitch. Oh no, that's right. I marked that dirt there to actually signify that I uh, had already been there. Amazing that I actually remembered that. Alright, I heard the zombie off this way again. This is the second time I've heard it. So let's, let's go with it. Let's go off this way. Sound whoring, guys. Sound whoring. Sound whoring. Sound whoring. He is right there. Question is where? And is he up or down? Or is he straight forward? I think he's up. Let's dig below myself a little bit. I think he's gotten quieter. Yeah, he got much quieter, so he was definitely above me. Not a big deal. That's what we do these tests. That's what these tests are for. Except it is above me, so I do need to be careful. Let's create ourselves like a little, uh, little protection area here. Whoa! There's lava. I do believe they are still above me. Now all I have left is my diamond pick. Which is kind of what I intended. Man, I hear them everywhere. I don't like being... I don't like having a no-block separation right there. Or like, literally, if they were to jump, pounce on... Oh, there they are. Let's, uh, let's, let's plug that up. Actually, is there... Okay, so there's a wall right there. So if I dig off this way a bit. All right. I'm just strategizing. I'm just strategizing, guys. So strategizing. So don't comment on my terrible terrible ability because you see Is that another? No. Man, I'm expecting dungeons now where I just shouldn't be. All right. I thought for a second I was out another sword, like a second sword or something. Because that, to me, would not make sense. Alright, let's place a couple torches right there. Yeah, come here. Come here, broski! You have no harm against me. Oh yeah, and I can use the map to see how far I've traveled away from my spawn in this cave system. Like, look, I'm below everything right now, so... Literally, the patterns that match, like I said before, the patterns that match up there, match down here. I hear stuff walking around on grass. Come here, bro. I will kill you. Thank you. Man, he was just sort of like alone here. Is it? Hey, there's a, an entrance up here. Nice. I like that. Alright, so now I have like an official entrance into this cave system. Um, debating whether or not I'll cut the episode off here, guys. But if it does cut off, cut off I'll definitely be continuing from right here. So, uh, if I do cut it off, I'll cut it off right here. But if not, we are going to continue. I just don't know how long the episodes are right now. That is a creepy structure. That is a weird structure. All right, let's, proce let's proceed down now. Um, yeah. If I had already cut off the episode, I would have just done it right there. Nice. Enjoying all of this, guys. Two zombies. What do we got? I don't think we got much of anything. I hear skeletons, though. Walking on top of grass. I feel like I'm going to be digging my way up to the surface right now. Let's actually head up. Let's head up out of here really, really quick. And I want to see what those are. What if there's like a surface dungeon there that I'm just blatantly missing? The noise is coming off from that way. 
So let's uh, let's note that. I've never seen a surface dungeon in this map before. Yeah, see, there's like a there was a there's an entrance over here, but it seems like that all leads into a mountain. So I definitely want to get back in there. See what's up. Can I hear anything from here? No, I can't. Or they just didn't make any noise to be heard with. That's all right. Let's head back. Is this the right area? Yeah, this is the one with the floor of uh, the floor coal. Let's figure out where these guys are. All right. So while I'm still in the safe zone, with the uh, 13 sticks, 14 coal, spam click, spam click. Let's make some. Let's make some stuff. All right. It's already made. And for them, shut up. But what good is my commentary if I don't shut up? Am I going insane? I hope I'm not going insane. It's only 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And it's outside that I'm hearing this. I think I might have to end this episode right here. There's a creeper. I hear it. I can smell it! Or maybe it was just maybe it was just uh, an, an innocent little sheep. Jeez, this is amazing. I honestly want to think about settling down here, maybe, or at the very least, you know. Ah, oh man, I wish I had more. Obs uh, I wish I had more obsidian because then I would place a real nether portal here. Is that? Hold on a second. I need to check something out. Yes, I know I'm going after these guys at random during the night. But you know what? This is how... I mean, it's how real men play Minecraft. You know, you deal with these guys during the night when they're an issue. Alright. No, I see... Uh, I saw sugarcane plants over there. And it looked like one of them was four high. And as far as I know, they can't get any higher than three high. So, you know, what, what the penis is that? Oh, I missed. Such an easy shot. Little lazy man's pathway. And I can still see the entrance to the area that I had over there. Let's place a little torch down to uh, to make up for it. Yeah, see this one is four high. I've never seen a sugarcane plant that's four high before. Where am I on the map? I am way over here. Way, way over here. Alright, let's take these, take these, take these, and these. And I think we're going to head back, guys. Although, this cave system will be revisited. This area will be revisited. It is absolutely amazing to look at. It's been a pleasure un underground so far. I hear a creeper coming after me. I hear two. And they're not getting after me. Man, I punch creepers. That's what I do. Punch creepers is what I do. Die. Oh, it's questioning. It's, it's explosion again. They do that to me all the time. Huh. It was weird that I saw the smoke cloud, like, not even where there was anything. Let's die. Alright. I'm dealing with all kinds of creepers today. <laughs> that was awesome. Happened right in front of my face. And I know you guys saw it, too. That is the amazing part. Why did you not come after me until I hit you twice? Really? I mean, really, guy? Really? Alright, let's do this. Ah, oh, it didn't explode. Ah, oh, but that didn't work. Oh, my god. Ah, oh, game over. Ah, oh, crap. Let's respawn. I have to head back. To, I have to head back there now. Because uh, I had a lot of crap on me. But I know where that was. Even I had my map on me. I don't remember exactly where it was because I don't have the map. <laughs> don't screw around. You screw around too much, Ant Venom. Alright, let's head back and let's end the episode. That's that's what my instincts are telling me. Let's head back there. Uh, yeah. I wish I, I should have brought the materials to make another map too. Hopefully it'll be daytime by the time I get there. And now I hear gas, of course. 
Okay, this is the cave. This is, I believe, the cave system that I was in. My health is terrible right now. Is this the cave system that I was in? I hope so. If it's not, I may end up losing my stuff here. Come on, skeleton, just burn off. I'm just, I need to run away from these guys as efficiently as I can. Oh, come on, don't kill me. Come on. It's daytime, come on! Don't kill me. Alright, there's the overhang. In which I came off... I came off in one of these directions. I might have to end the episodes. I don't, I don't really know. I may have to just... Oh, okay, here we go. Here we go. I went off this way. Because I saw that structure. I went off on top of this hill here. I might still be able to get my stuff back, guys. I went off in one of these directions. Which direction was it? Oh, and I can't retrace from my videos right now because I'm still just recording. Okay, beach. Beach. Tall thing. Beach. Yes! There we go. And it's daytime, too. But I still have to worry about creepers and my own safety. Okay, though. I just might be able... Uh, my voice broke. I just might be able to get my stuff back. If I'm lucky, I have to be really lucky right now in order to get my stuff back. I came over here, and I, I went after this sugar cane, wondering what was going on, and then I saw, I just kept going. I was messing with creepers and stuff, went off this way. I hear a zombie, but it's underground. I kept going off this way, I was screwing around. Here's all my stuff. Let's get it now, let's get it, and let's get it now. My map, everything. Alrighty then, guys. That was a true adventure, and figuring out how to get back here too. I'm, I'm kind of impressed with myself for being able to get it back. All of my stuff, anyways. Uh, let's get rid of this gravel. Search, exchange for that. Get rid of all the useless crap that I don't need. Make sure there are no creepers up here. Huh. <sighs> that was close. Very close. Give me my food back, please, and thanks. Oh, and I feel like I'm going to sneeze, so I'm going to end the video right here on that note, guys. Um, Yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. Uh, I believe this was two episodes of Hunt for the Golden Apple. I really believe that it was. Um, so, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. My name is Ant Venom, and if you haven't already checked out already the amount of Minecraft madness that I have on my channel at youtube.com slash antvenom, I highly recommend that you do, uh, because I actually do a lot of Golden Apple stuff on that world, or on that channel, in this world that you guys don't see here on Machinima, so I highly recommend you check that out. Anyways, guys, though, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Um, my name is Ant Venom, and I bid you all farewell. Thanks so much for watching, and let me see if this map still works, just for the sake of curiosity, and it does. So, we will be able to head home.